gold sword hilt inlaid with jewels. This belonged to a Byzantine noble. Hmm. The blade itself was snapped off at the base. Did this happen in battle? It is clear to me now that our communications have been sabotaged. You likely have received none of my cables for quite some time. But I will continue transmitting as it is my duty. Local natives attacked us on multiple fronts soon after we attempted to sway them with the executions of their countrymen. There are far more natives than we ever anticipated. It is clear that they come from the other side of the mountain and have been preparing their revolt carefully for years. We are now without power and water, and winter is upon us. Those of us who remain will soon be leaving. We have one train transport that we will take with us as many records and artifacts as we can.
strong enough. strong enough.
Right, that should work. If I can bring down that crane, it should be enough to rip open the door. Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope wedge. Not strong enough. Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope winch. Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope winch. Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope winch. Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope winch. shows the exodus of his people from the deserts of Syria. They settled in a hidden valley and built a great city. Kadesh. To protect the city and its people, the Prophet raised an army of warriors. But what is this showing? It's not the divine source they're holding. Something else, something else, but what? And his warriors forged for him an atlas. That the prophet might always know his city and its secrets. A map of the city. It could show the way to the divine source.
It's a wonder this place is still standing. Even damaged, the artistry is stunning. Right there. Easy. Easy. You know I'm not with Trinity. Why should we believe you? I escaped with one of yours. A man named Jacob. Where is he now? We were together, but we got separated in the mines. She killed him! No! No, 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 no! Jacob would never trust an outsider. Please, listen, I am not your enemy. I warned you. You should have left. Sophia! Enough! Father! I thought I lost you. I'm glad you made it out of there. Or give Sophia, she is cautious. In her position, I'd be the same way. What did you find out? Trinity is coming in force. We must prepare. Her? She's a friend. On my word, no harm will come to her. These ruins. They must be near the Prophet's lost city. Come. We do not have much time. Prepare the weapon stores. Secure the battlements. Go! Now! They're almost here. But we're outnumbered. The children and elders are vulnerable. Go. Get them into the catacombs. Light the fires. The valley must be alert. Incredible. Sophia, muster our fighters. Then meet me in the upper village. Don't disappear again, Father. There's much to do. We had more time. Later. For now, I'll do what I can to help. Vase must have been beautiful once, but someone's poked a few new holes in it and filled it with dirt. They must have used it to grow seedlings. Settlements 
to know what's coming. I'll do what I can. You two. I need eyes out across the valley. Head to the cliffs and take watch. I want to know the moment you see their helicopters. Yes, of course. If we see anything, we'll sound the horn. Go with go. Ready for this. We knew better, damn it. I need more wood for the fire. They needed most of the lumber to repair the guard towers. We'll have to make do with what we have. Well, if they need arrowheads for the battle, then I need more firewood. I've already cut plenty. Besides, I don't know. Really... Can you see anything from up there? No, we can make I'm trying to get the structure repaired. You want the whole thing to fall when the wind picks up? Just keep your eyes out. You could be here at any moment. Now I'll this. do what I can. If you want to help, you should head down to the lower village. I ran out of the air. We can pull more out of the old cabins. Another difficult winter for my people. There are more deaths and births now. And as the seasons pass, the young ones are becoming restless. I see them looking to the sky when the rare plane passes overhead. Wistful. Wondering. Longing. I know they are still deeply committed to the cause. But I also sense a change coming. An end to our way of life is on the horizon. The most recent invaders are fading from memory. But as the technology of men advances, more are bound to find our valley again. And we are bound with the fate of this place. For better, or worse. The ones we don't use anymore. Ones. You scoffed at learning your letters. Said it had nothing to do with hunting. But that's your first lesson. Everything is connected. And I am always right. You clever students who saw the folly and stubbornness and can read this, here's your first assignment. Track. Hunt. And bring me back the pelt of one of the small creatures of the valley. Hairs you can find anywhere, night or day. Both the little brown ones in our valley and the snow hares in the peaks. The squirrels stick to the trees, and rain will drive them into their burrows. And, if you see fit to seek the rats, look inside the ruins, or anywhere the dead still lie. Please, do not bring me a rat.
Here is your lesson for today. Bring me any creature with feathers. The birds in our valley fly mostly by day, nesting away at dark. You've seen gulls and other kinds farther afield. Those common birds would count for today's lesson, but it would lack ambition. You clever students who wish to impress me would do well to head to the high elevations between dawn and dusk. I would find buzzard most impressive. And before you ask, the chickens around our village came here with our ancestors. Bringing me a tame bird from your mother's yard will not fulfill the assignment. Followers of the Prophet fled to the east. The journey was difficult. <laughs> <laughs> 